have a very weird political agenda. I mean, you know, for instance, I don't want to get into an air clawing rave about this, but I feel as a as a person who was raised Catholic that I have a certain license to criticize my own subgroup. I think that, you know, the Third Reich was a Sunday school picnic in terms compared to the population policies of the Roman Catholic Church. They will shove millions of people per year into poverty, disease, and death in the, in, in the pursuit of a theological doctrine that nobody understands the sense of. Uh, in a civilized, uh, in a civilized uh, political environment, those people would be placed under immediate arrest, just like we did the leadership of the Nazis. I do not understand how you can call yourself pro-life when the policies that you espouse mean planetary death. That's the program of the pro-life position. More starvation, more agony, more wars, more destroyed land, more toxic output in the name of being pro-life? What kind of a... What have words come to mean? I mean, it's really bizarre. And we, even us, in this room, the thing that was so great about the 60s and that is so frustrating about the 90s is people do not get pissed off. I mean, you know, I can, I can tell you this and you can nod in agreement, but, you know, at some point the thing becomes so odious, so clearly intellectually bankrupt, so clearly toxic, to any kind of human values that any of us can relate to that you just have to uh, put yourself on the line. And I don't know when that moment will come. It's not for me to say. I guess a switch will be turned in the unconscious. But there's enough evidence of outrage and, and uh, uh, muddle-headedness and outright evil around that sooner or later we're going to have to confront it. Otherwise, you know, this is a sinking submarine. And, and uh, there is no way out unless people who really understand uh, the gravity of the situation and the stakes uh, make their voices heard. If we leave it up to the institutions that have been put in place over the last 500 years, these are anti-human institutions. These institutions hate the human race, hate ordinary people. And uh, until we wake up to this, we're going to be their victims. We're the marks. Well, how do you like being a mark? You can just take so much of that, and then you just finally have to stand up and say enough, you know?